Good morning YouTube. This is Johnny. I thought I'd make a video. Today is May the 24th. It's a Wednesday morning, late morning at 1049. My wife left this morning to have breakfast with a friend and I'm here by myself. <clears throat> I always feel kind of restless in the mornings, but then once I get to the the noon hour I kind of just settle down and just float through the rest of the day and also tomorrow my wife and I are going to Freeport which is north of us and we're going to a library used book sale and then we're going to go to Grand Haven which is right by there and go to Cheap Stacks the Grand Haven library used bookstore and so I figured why go out if <laughs> tomorrow I'm going to go out with my wife. Uh, my wife is going to also to visit her aunt who is in a, oh, what do you call it, uh, assistant living, but I think she's in hospice and she's quite frail and my, my wife, this is her last, her, uh, her mother's younger sister, her mother passed away a number of years ago, and this is the youngest sister of my wife's mother, so she probably wants to, she could pass away, and my wife wants to say goodbye and pray with her and all that. But what I want to do this morning is some, something different, I must sneeze. Just kind of pollen in the air. Uh, I have a friend named Carm, uh, Carmen, C A R Carm, and he does music videos and he lives in Chicago. And I've been watching him for a number of years. And as you all know, besides books, I'm into music. But due to my uh, I can't find my my dictionary all of a sudden is gone due to my tinnitus in my ear my left ear I, I can't I can't listen to music as much as I used to uh, noise any kind of loud noise kind of irritates me so I don't listen as much music anymore, but I still buy music and I still listen to it. But uh, if I sense within myself, I'm getting irritated or I'm getting uh, uncomfortable, I turn it off. But I do listen to it and, my, and I was watching yesterday my, Karm's video and he mentioned Asset Mother's Temple. He went and saw them in Chicago in concert. Now, I uh, for a number of years, I collected the music of Asset Mother's Temple, and they have they go under different different uh, like you have Asset Mother's Temple, the Cosmic Inferno. They have Asset Mother's Temple and the Melting Perseo UFO. And they have, you know, they have, but they're all, I think, basically, they're all the same members in the band. And they're a Japanese kind of avant-garde, noise, rock, extreme kind of pop kind of rock. And I was really into them for a while until, I don't know, I go through phases of music. You all know. For a couple of years, I went through death metal and black metal. That was a couple, about almost two years ago. And I, and of course, two years ago, I, I was afflicted with this tinnitus in my ear. And also I went through a kind of a spiritual kind of an awakening. Uh, I just stopped listening to certain kind of music but I still listen to music and I still buy music 
but not well I, I realized when I got into death and black metal it kind of became very repetitious and there were so many groups bands and all different kinds of death and black metal you had that I just kind of grew tired of it it became kind of repetitious and and I always liked all kinds of music singer songwriter blues rock classic music uh, and plus as I said I got into a place where I couldn't listen to music as much as I used to I just I don't know I just changed but my friend Karim, I, I commented on his videos today that I had listened to Acid Mother's Temple and I had CDs and he said, could I show them? He, he had a request. So I, I this is for Karm. <laughs> uh, as far as my diary, I'm on page 435. Uh, I was going to prepare my June 2023 diary, but I think this, I don't have enough time to film it, so I'm not going to do that. I have my May ready to, I think that we're coming to the last week of June, no, last week of May, and then we have June coming up. This is what I do, but I'll, I'll do that separate from this video because I'm just going to show the a book I got in the mail yesterday <clears throat> I ordered this book used paradise artificial paradise this is a drug reader <laughs> and this is edited by Mike J and as you all know I've been reading the the books of Mike J he, uh, this is Atmosphere of Heaven, The Unnatural Experiments of Dr. Beldus, Bedus, and His Sons of Genius. And I've been reading Psychonauts, Drugs, and the Making of the Modern Mind. And he writes about drug history, history of cocaine, opium, psychedelics, cannabis, hashi, and from a very scientific, medical, kind of cultural history, kind of perspective, biograph biogra biography, history of science, all kinds of interesting subjects, and very well researched. His books are very well researched, and I plan to buy his book on musculine, and his book called he has other books that I want to buy. I, his books are very fascinating, and I want to buy all of them. <laughs> yeah, he wrote one, uh, High Society, Musculine, The Atmosphere of Heaven. Uh, he's just really a, a very fine writer if you're into that kind of subject matter. So I'm still reading Martin Ames, The Rachel Papers, as, we, as I mentioned in my last video. On May the 19th, Martin Amos, a very prominent British writer, died, and I collect his writings. This is his first novel, so I've been reading it. So I got this uh, Paradise, Artificial Paradises, a drug reader edited by Mike J. I've been reading that. So that's out of the way. Writing in my diary. This morning, I've been reading for devotions, A Theology of the Christian Life by Christopher R. This is called the the A Theology of the Christian Life, Imitating and Participating in God. But this is a very interesting book, so I've been reading that. So, I'm already going 10 minutes into this video. And so, I'll show the videos for Karm. And I, I stopped collecting Asset Mother's Temple. Oh, I don't know when the last time I, I bought one. 
But what happened is I realized at one time I couldn't keep up, keep up with buying them because I wanted other music and I didn't have an infinite resource of money. So I, and, the, and there's all kind you know, I couldn't buy everything, but so I'm just gonna show this for Carm. This is my, I'm just, there's no particular chronological order of how these came out. But the one I have here is Asset Mother's Temple, The Melting Perseo UFO. And this is NC. This one came out in, I didn't say, I can't see any name. But I have this one. And then Asset Mother's Temple, The Melting Pot, Perseo per UFO, Electric Heavy Land. And then there's Asset Mother's Temple, The Melting Pot, Perseo. Per UFO I got this one and then Asset Mother's Temple, The Melting Pot, Pissero, UFO, Interstellar, Guru, and Zero Asset Mother's Temple, The Cosmic Inferno Just another Band from the Cosmic Inferno. And then I have Asset Mother's Temple, the Melting Pot for Sale, UFO. Asset Mother's Temple and the Melting Per Sale, UFO, the day before the sky fell. Uh, this is... A.O. Chant from the Cosmic Inferno, Asset Mother's Temple and the Cosmic Inferno. Asset Mother's Temple and the Melting Pot goes the Cosmic Shepherd Dream of Electric Taurus. Uh, Asset Mother's Temple, the Cosmic Inferno. And then there is Asset Mother's Temple, the Melting Pot, the Melting Persero, <laughs> the Melting Pot, that's not the name. Have I been saying that? Forgive me. Asset Mother's Temple and the Cosmic Inferno, Starless and Bible Black Sabbath. Yeah, if you listen to the Asset Mother's Temple, they're influenced by... Uh, my mind just went blank. <laughs> Black Sabbath. I just, my mind just went blank, completely blank. Anyway, uh, Classic Rock. What's that group called? Uh, I just, you know, old age. I'm, I'm going on 71 years old. Asset Mother's Temple and the Melting Persero UFO. Lord of the Underground. Vishu and the Magic. Alexter. So these are the ones I have in Asset Mother's Temple. Also, Carm, uh, I didn't know that Asset Mother's Temple and the band members had band camp sites. And this morning I ripped, I ripped off or MP3 uh, Asset Mother's Temple, the Ripper at the the Ripper at the Heaven's Gate of Dark. I, this is like 2020. They didn't, they have vinyl. I don't buy vinyl. <laughs> I can't afford vinyl and I'm not that of a, a, a vinyl kind of collector. I buy MP3, MP3s or CDs. But I got the, I burned this one today because it's, what was that group called? I saw them when I was in high school. They were a British group. I can't remember what the name is. My, it, I've been noticing my memory is getting shorter and shorter. It kind of scares me sometimes. Uh, 
I have to I have to write things down. <laughs> anyway, maybe it'll come to me before the end of this tape. Also, in my karm, he mentioned um, Mary Kaplan Carpenter, and I do have some CDs by her. I have I didn't have the CD that Karm showed, but I have Place in the World by Mary Kaplan Carpenter. I have Party Doll and Other Favorites by Mary Kaplan Carpenter. I have Time, Sex, Love by Mary Kaplan Carpenter. Between Here and Gone by Mary Kaplan Carpenter. She's a singer-songwriter, very mellow kind of music, but I like her music. Stones in the Road by Mary Kaplan Carpenter. Mary Kaplan Carpenter, The Calling. This is, she's, um, Come On, Come On by Mary Kaplan Carpenter. These all came into the book nook a couple months ago, maybe a year ago, and I bought them all for, I think they were like $2 a piece. I also mentioned to Carm to check out the music of Ghost. He's a Japanese uh, music artist, I kind of mixing in Japanese with rock, ambient, experimental music. And this is uh, Ghost, S Smut Box, Eminence. This is Ghost, I, I don't think he makes any more records. Ghosts and Stormy Nights. Uh, Ghost, Hypnotic Underworld. And Ghosts, this is Second Time Around by Ghosts. I used to be really into, I don't think Ghosts didn't make that many records, but I have a DVD, Ghost, Metamorphosis, Ghost Chronicles, 1984 to 2004. So I used to be, you know, as I, as you all know, I'm really, I was really into music and I, I still buy music, but not much as I used to due to my ear infection. <laughs> also, somebody commented on Carm's uh, video and he mentioned that uh, Damon, uh, Damien and Naomi did an album with Ghost and this is it. Uh, I saw Damien and Naomi in concert a couple years ago, but Ghost wasn't with them. But this, uh, I got this out to listen to today. I have other CDs by Damien and Naomi. Uh, he also mentioned uh, Carm's friend, Galaxy 500. I have their CDs. If I remember, the lead singer in Galaxy 400 not 400, 500, Galaxy 500 is in the gr group Luna. Now, I'm not really sure since my memory is, is disappearing. <laughs> so yeah, this is for Karm. This is, or he had a request to see my Asset Mother Temples. And I don't have the, he showed Carm showed the, uh, he had CDs by the lead guitarist in, and his name is, oh, I can't remember if it's listed here. What's his name? I couldn't pronounce his name anyway, but the lead singer, the, the lead guitarist, he has his own band camp site. I'll list it below this video, his name, and you can check out his band camp site. But yeah, this is for Karm, Asset Mother's Temple, Asset Mother's Temple, uh, Mary Kaplan Carpenter, Ghost, Naming, 
Damien and Naomi, this is kind of mellow, kind of singer-songwriter, kind of pop, kind of, kind of music. It's not really going to blow your brain. <laughs> so yeah, it's going on 20 minutes. This thing shuts down in 22 minutes. So yeah, I'm writing in my diary, writing in my diary, reading a theology of the Christian life imitating and participating in God by Christopher R.J. Holmes, reading Martin Amos, The Rachel Papers. I'm almost done with this. I have two books of his coming in the mail used. Uh, yes, when I got this book, Artificial Paradises, a drug reader edited by Mike J. I read this yesterday, sitting outside in the front. Also, I've been reading this book, otherwise known as the human condition selected essays and reviews by Jeff Dyer and uh, reading the other books by Mike J. So that's what's going on. Hope you're all having a good week. This is uh, Wednesday, like tomorrow morning we're going to go to a used book sale at Freeport Library, go to Cheap Stacks, visit thrift stores. My wife will visit her and the day will go by. So I hope you have a good reading week. Thank you for all the new subscribers. Thank you for your comments. Do pray you're all doing well. And until next time, bye. And hi, Carm. Hi to your cats. I hope you're all doing well. Thank you. And uh, yeah, check out, if you like extreme music, check out Asset Mother's Temple. If you like something more metal, check out Mary Taplin Carpenter. Also, somebody mentioned in that comment, Lucinda Williams. Check her music out. She, she just read a memoir, Lucinda Williams, which I plan to buy. She's a, a great artist too. More Americana, country, kind of rock. Uh, she's really a great singer-songwriter, Lucinda Williams. So check her out too. So until next time, Bye.